Robin's uh, stressed out because, well, I'm way up on the ladder and he, or she, decided to put her nest right up there. You can just sort of see it. Well, there's another nest right up there. Um, yeah, right in the corner there. I'm not sure you can see that really good, but I'm way up here on a ladder. Whoa. Looking right down, I'm just working on the uh, house wrap because I'm getting uh, soffit eaves and uh, fascia and all the good stuff put on here next week. So I think next week. Don't quote me on that. Could be wrong. But, uh, anyways. I got four quotes actually and one guy came in a thousand dollars less from everybody else because I'll tell you a little bit about it. When you mention you're from a city and you're building in the country, the price automatically goes up by a lot. But I found a person in uh, Brandon, Manitoba uh, has a company and they're a thousand dollars less so they're at least being honest with their pricing which I can appreci appreciate because uh let me tell you sure hurts the pocket when people are overpriced and one person was way over by 1300 another guy by 1100 another person by about uh I guess around I guess around the 10 50 1100 right and then the last guy that I contacted was uh, in that thousand uh, dollars less than everybody. So, and uh, their established business called Brandon Eaves and Troughs. I think that's what they're called. I have to look at my quote, but uh, uh, I appreciate the honest pricing. So, anyways, I'm gonna get down from this ladder. I just about bailed off of it, and that, uh, that, uh, I had a really good YouTube video if I was taping it, but uh, I forgot, uh, I was putting these lights up here, and I'm uh, moving the ladder back and forth, and I'm measuring, and I put the, uh, tape measure on top of the ladder, and, of course, I, uh, went to move the ladder without thinking, because I was rushing, and, uh, and I got kabonked on the head by the tape measure, and so, but that's, uh, that's a lesson learned. Just slow down a bit and it'll come. And right now it's sun's getting low. So I still have to do the other side, just a little bit on the other side of the house. I'm gonna try getting it done tonight. It's taking a long time to do this here. So um yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna get down here. I'm gonna move the ladder over because I want to get in that corner right up there. I forgot to hammer all those staples and it's bugging me. So, and then I'm gonna go to that side and I'm gonna tie back or not tie back, put the tuck tape on there and cut all that trim. And I'm gonna be putting cedar board up or cedar shingles, sorry, or cedar shakes, sorry. Part of my uh, little bit of a tongue twister there. Or not tongue twisted, tongue tied, tongue tied. The, anyways, that's what's going there. So cedar shakes, right? So I, I believe that's cedar shakes. So and then uh, I'll work into the night. My neighbors won't mind. They're way, way over there, and way, way over there. So I'm not too worried. But I just got to finish that. So and then I got to get up at five in the morning and drive back to Winnipeg. So. <sighs> So, yeah, anyways, so, I gotta also uh, get some really good weed killer, or, um, yeah, I'm gonna get some, something, these, uh, these weeds are going crazy, last week I trimmed this and then sprayed it with Roundup, and, uh, 
I'm going to see if I can get some heavier duty stuff and put it in here and get rid of all this. And when I do my landscaping, I'm going to be going to the top of the blue skin and then coming down. Um, I will put uh, like carpet, black carpet on here, really heavy duty stuff and just kill that weed and then put the grass in. So there's the birdie up there. She's hiding, robbing. Somewhere kicking around. I don't know. This is my fire pit area. And uh, and the uh, tractor and there's a robin fly up in there. Let's just take a peek. Nope. Well, there she is. There she is. Let's see. She's watchful. She's like, hey man, get away from my nest. There she goes up. And her nest. So. Anyway. Anyways. I'm gonna let her be. She's probably stressed right out. Poor girl. Hey? Eh? Taking care of your little ones. Yeah. You can stay there for now. Of course, that'll be gone when they put the uh, soffits and everything up there. But anyways, I'm going to get back to work because it's getting late. And I'm going to finish this and go around the other side. And uh, next week, I'll do another video. Anyways, thanks for watching. Subscribe. Give us your likes. Ask questions. And uh, it's always nice to have a thumb up once in a while. So, appreciate it, and uh, thanks for watching.